I can't believe this. I showed up at work and the campus cops were there asking questions about Penelope. Where do you work? At a medical research lab on campus. We're in the biochem PhD program. Do you know of any medications that Penelope was taking? She has asthma. She carries an inhaler. Any recent injuries that you know of? No. She works out all the time, though. She's been getting ready for her wedding. Oh, she's getting married? Well, she was supposed to. I'm not sure what's going on now. She flew out to California last week to visit her fiancé, but they got into a big fight, so she came back early. Do you know how to get in touch with her fiancé? I'd like to ask him a couple of questions. Sure. His name's Jared. He was in the undergrad program with us. Hey, Pam. Do you have a second? Excuse me. Hey. How's she doing? Oh, we did what we could, but she lost a lot of blood. So whoever her people are, get them down here ASAP. You may be feeling better, but you're not out of the woods yet. Don't blame me. She told me to bring her work. And my favorite robe and some of my things. Most people use major surgery as an excuse not to work. Those people don't have tenure track positions. You know what they say, publish or perish. You push it too far and the perish part might actually happen. Mm -hmm. Your boss came by. Dr. Gold? Mm -hmm. He spoke to Dr. Lee. Sounds like he had to run before he could see you. What's going on? <laughs> Dr. Gold had this minor obsession with Penn. His wife got wind of it and now he just skulks around, barely talks to her. It's creepy and uncomfortable. Well, for now, you can hide out in here with us. Ten more minutes, then it's pencils down. <laughs> 